this is a real time clock and calendar circuit with two alarms the microcontroller used here is peak 18f4550 which is this one and the real time clock circuit integrated circuit is used is the ds1307 which is this integrated circuit here here we have an lcd display it's 2004 lcd display here we have a cell 3 volt battery it's 3 volt cell battery it's connected to the ds1307 real time clock chip here we have three push buttons these push button sets the time and date parameters and this one sets the alarm one and alarm two hours and minutes this button here increments the selected parameter for both the time and the alarm which is selected by these two buttons here we have an LED used to indicate alarm one and this is a buzzer to indicate used to indicate alarm two now let's start testing and adjusting the time and date and also the alarms here we have uh, we are at the initial state the clock is there is it's not running as we can see let's now start adjusting the time and the date using this push button here As we can see the number here zero zero starts blinking it's for the hours now by pressing this one we can increment the number okay now let's repress this button here now we can adjust the minutes okay okay it's blinking here which means we can now set the day like this it's sunday monday tuesday wednesday thursday friday saturday sunday monday tuesday now let's set the date the month and this is the last one is the year okay we have finished adjusting or setting the time and date and the clock starts running as we can see now let's set the alarms the alarms for alarm 1 and alarm 2 are set using this button here okay we can turn it on or off okay let's wait until we reach the time for the alarm one and alarm two as known okay this is indicates alarm one as known the ds1307 uses 
I2C protocol to communicate with the microcontroller here the microcontroller in this circuit uses its I2C module to interface with the DS1307 its pins are connected to RB0 and RB1 for SDA and SCL respectively for this circuit here the buzzer is connected to RC2 pin which is PWM1 output ok as we can hear the buzzer starts output sound as we can hear now this is our alarms we can turn it turn the alarms off using this button here okay both alarms are off here the peak 18f4550 uses its internal oscillator at 8 megahertz so there is no oscillator here and the unclear pin function is disabled in this circuit project